we're consistently making more and more as the autonomy goes down. I'll decrease the autonomy up there. Yeah, that's our issue. We're paying for this state, but we're not getting any really benefits to it. Okay, one of our guys disappeared again because they had no influence, I guess. They'll be back, I guess, eventually. Clergy. <laughs> Alright, so maybe we'll eventually be able to pay off our freaking loan. Our inflation is not doing too hot either. It's just probably not. Yeah, that's not helping. Oh yeah, you do see the double, double Desmond. That's beautiful. Yeah, that means we're doing great. And with our triple alliance here, the triple entente uh, between us and Scotland and France, we'll be okay. Wow, that mission went quickly. And no mission? Really game? Really game? Come on, game. Mission? Give me mission. We should, like, move our capital to Dublin, but I think that's going to happen when we, uh, hit the button anyways, right? No. Hm. That's true, we do have enough men anyways. Good, we repaid all of our loans. Okay, I can accumulate money, I guess. How much is it? $56. It's insane. <clears throat> we got to tech up. Yay. We'll get ourselves some ideas next. Uh, we're going to obviously go with the exploration ideas like we did last time, but now hopefully once our autonomy goes down, we'll be able to actually afford... To have stuff. Oh, crap. Uh, our new king is really good. There is Pretender, though. And we got our marriage, okay. That's cool. Alright. So we're gonna have to pay for our army, unfortunately. Oh, it's not so bad. We actually don't. Make, we actually make money. <clears throat> All right, and they're gonna take a minus one because it's gonna be woods, and hopefully we'll be able to get to full morale. One more month, yeah, we should have morale. All right, let's see. We started at half their morale. I don't know why. Oh, they're pretender rebels, so they get plus one point two five. Okay, they did take a minus one, so hopefully that'll save us. We have our good general, too, which is also apparently coming in very handily. There we go, good. All right, unfortunately, though, these are the kind of rebels that can't, that don't just get wiped. Once you defeat them once, they can, can survive, but it doesn't matter because we killed them. All right. And now we don't pay for the army. <laughs> All right. But now we have a freaking boss leader. Look at that, 11 Diplo per month. That's awesome. Now we can just, you know, go on super speed here. Let's go to counter spy against England. So they can't fabricate as many claims. <clears throat> France is doing well. Good. Let's offer the military access. Same thing with uh, Scotland. So let's hurry up and do that accumulate money thing. 
There we go. We got our national ideas. We get our first group of ideas, which I said were going to be exploration. You know, I really don't understand why they give you the colonists first with exploration. You should really get the conquistadors and stuff first, but that's uh, just me. We're going to pick the uh, coexistence thing so we don't have to babysit our colonies. And uh, we should get, well, we'll leave our guys. We have plenty of trade ships. So we're going to have a colonist sitting around doing nothing, probably for a good while. But, you know, as opposed to sitting around and waiting for colonies when we only had four provinces, we're going to be in a much better situation now that we have the entire island of Ireland and half of, well, a foothold on the, the English side, too. The most it's the most glorious <laughs> oh man this guy said he's like uh the weed fairy just visited my house are you gonna colonize greenland it's the most glorious island yeah 420 blaze it i'm hip i'm hip hi there king z, z king zoo the fair there you go. Right. i just struggled with your name a little bit not so bad this is normal and i missed us getting our event or p passing the mission so oh well No, there's ten other people with the yeah, King Zoo. Or, well, well, nine other people. Math. Math is hard. <laughs> Our advisor died. Oh, I forgot we even had an advisor. That's why we were losing money. <laughs> Durr. I don't really want to get any advisors right now. We have, we're making plenty of monarch points as it stands. If I got an advisor, it's going to be the colonial range guy, but I don't, we don't even have one of those, so... Well, I'll just sit here and rake in the cash. 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 Let's go ahead and uh, fund our army for a bit and pay for the reinforcements. Uh, let's go ahead and appease our clergy and stuff if we can. Good, now the clergy is back. <laughs> I guess when they lose all their influence or whatever, they just disappear. But, you know, that's that's EU4 for you. Um, of course we'll hire him. Thank you for the maxing out our prestige game. Good for you. Thanks. Utrecht. Screw you, Utrecht. Can we not still, can we still not uh, set them as rival? Why, why, why can't I set England as rival? We're almost the same size now. Allied with Scotland? What? God damn you, Scotland, you freaking turncoat traitors. They're like, ooh, we're going to go to war with uh, you now, Ireland. <laughs> the fuck you are. Scotland is calling me to arms. Oh, I guess Sweden's trying to break. Oh no, Denmark is just fighting. Scotland is just declared on them for, I guess, up here, maybe? Yeah, they want their highlands. What ifs? Sure, I guess you can have access, England. I don't, I don't even know what's going on, barely, but all I know is that we're going to start exploring now. So let me grab these guys. We're going to split off six ships. Or three, I think. Some three over there. We're gonna need to wait a month or so, anyways, because we need to we need fifty diplo points to recruit an explorer. But nevertheless, the boats will be ready. Can we even afford another general? 
No, technically not. Oh well. Well, we successfully fought their navy. <clears throat> I don't know why Ireland bothered to rent those troops. So we could fight against England now if we wanted to. Probably not a good idea. What's England at right now? 26k? Yeah, and we have not saved up enough at all to really go to war with them. But, you know, just because we're thinking about it, let's go ahead and uh, build Spy Network on them. Denmark, you should have taken my alliance. Damn you. Uh, yeah, we don't want them to gain. God, I want to be out of this war so I can decrease the autonomy. <laughs> Alright, let's get an explorer going. Send him south so maybe the those guys won't chase him. That's not going to go well. <laughs> 81%. Oh, well, France got on there. I didn't even realize France was in this war with us. Oh, and we only need the one more tank over here. How are we doing on the uh, old Reformation, Reformation, Reformation Rooney? I was trying to say that in a funny way, but that did not work at all. I just stumbled over it really hard. <sighs> yeah, let's uh, go ahead and fabricate another claim. This is Gloucestershire, we already have one. Sue marches. How's our force limit doing? Better, better, better. Should be fine to have those two extra infantry units. Where are we going, bro? Why are you stuck over here? Bro. Okay, it's just thinking, I guess. No, Cornwall, we need that province. Guess we'll gain the 50 admin, yeah. Who cares about inflation? We don't even have an inflation cost dude. And wow, the Reformation's being put off pretty good. It's only at 57%. It's pretty dope. For the Catholic countries, I mean, we're going to want to convert, of course, like I said. But uh, So we're going to definitely want to keep an eye on that. 
It's kind of going to be hard, though, because I'm going to get lost in colonization and stuff, and that's not good. We don't want to do that. I don't want to forget again. No! I must claim all of England. Can do another military tech. We'll want to get this uh, this idea here, the expanded range, but maybe after that we will worry about stuff. Oh, we get ten of them out. We got ten ducats. Oh, and now they owe us favors too. Sweet. Oh, Burgundy died. Burgundy died and Castile got them. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Well, uh, that's good. That makes our ally France over here more powerful. Good for you. So how many units does uh, England have now? 28? Still quite formidable. Now that you owe us all these favors, Scotland, will you come? Hmm. I'll wait for France to just declare their own war again. Okay, oh, they finally finished that exploration. Good, now we can do the North Atlantic. He didn't really even explore too much because our range is shit. Castile has a zero, zero, zero. What? Oh my god, they do! Oh, get wrecked, freaking lucky nations bonus. <laughs> oh my god, they both have zero because it's a personal union. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. They suck so bad. Alright, let's send our non-cogs to go protect trade. In the Great North Sea. Alright, we're gonna get our claim again. And there we go, I think we have claims on all of them. Wow, and our coalition, we don't even, they have only six aggressive expansion, Jesus. I'm glad, I guess they toned that down in this, because it may, maybe if you're taking territorial as opposed to regular course. That's awesome. I'll take the admin points, thanks. I'll, I guess I'll let that tick off, because we already have plus three stability, so. Well, we're going to get Renaissance Thought. It's going to give us access to another group of ideas. I don't know what we're going to do with that yet. Maybe military ideas. I thought we planned on doing economic. However, I'm not sure. <laughs> Circumnavigate. Uh, we planned on doing economic because, um, you know, that'd be a good idea for us to make more money. But I don't know if we're going to want to spend the admin now or not. Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Anyways, regardless, I know we can probably defund the army. Uh, and we can stop doing this in England. Now let's counter espionage them. And keep on improving. Let's top off relations with France over here. Uh, yeah, for it's a good idea. We stopped England in their tracks. Hmm. 